So today we're going to have a look at how to make this abalone shell waterfall tray. You'll need Apex UV resin and they're just for you stunning abalone shells, each one delicious. Your mould, UV resin which we'll place at the bottom of the dish and then just push it to the edges and the abalone shells. Now remember the bottom of the mould is going to be what you see so you want to choose your little pieces and place those so that you are going to be viewing it once you've demoulded it from the underneath. Make sure that is fully cured, then turn it over and cure that side as well. Then we're going to use Apex High Gloss Resin mixed with their Jet Black. Now this truly is a black, it's absolutely gorgeous. Pour that over and then we'll allow that to cure for 24 hours and then we shall come back and do the next stage. So this is cured now and we shall be building up our little waterfall feature. Here it is in all its beauty. Oh, those shells. <laughs> so we'll need the UV resin again. And what we'll do is we will place that where we want to be putting our shells and then build up our little waterfall, layering up the resin, curing in between until we've reached all the way up and over the edge just popping the shells wherever you want to making sure we keep curing and we'll carry on doing that for a little bit we want to make sure that they're over the edge as well so it really does cover the side and look like it's trickling over We're adding some to the other side as well, just for a bit more depth. And then we'll make sure all of that is fully cured again. And here it is. It's oh, just so beautiful, those shells are. So now we want to edge it with the resin edges from Just For You. This is the champagne edging pen. They do gold, blush, copper, silver and champagne. These pens are incredible, truly non-scratch, easy to apply. Just layer up and let, allow to dry in between each layer. And there we have it. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you've learnt something or picked up an idea or two. Um, if you have, we'd love to hear about it in the comments. Take care.